Here there is a uh, water damage as you see one is minus and one is plus we call so minus we can say it low side injector section plus we can say high side injector section IC the switching of this small IC 8 pin IC okay so 8 pin IC needs one 5 voltage reference one is ground will switching at one time for two injector but low side have a another another each injector have each MOSFET hello everyone this is Ozil welcome back to my channel so today we have a Captiva ECM and in this ECM I have a problem in injector section so now I am going to explain all the injector section low side and high side high side in every ECM high side have to uh, travel 2 voltage one is 12 voltage another is 48 voltage and in uh, ground uh, in low side only ground travel via N channel MOSFET in high side also use N channel MOSFET for switching but its location will be different okay so let's let's i'm going to explain it okay you can see here there is a uh, water damage as you see okay now i have one injector i have one injector like that okay and this have two pin one is minus and one is plus we call minus every injector needs two voltage a minus one is minus another is plus okay so minus we can say it low side injector section and in plus we can say high side injector section okay so you know that the low side injector section working like we have a n channel mosfet and the low side will work like it this is the diode for protections and one side of diode here is a 48 volt okay and the source is connected to the ground and the drain is on injector IC this is the injector IC as you know that okay so this is the low side very simple injector IC command is MOSFET on the time this ground out and play the this injectors and uh, this have a low high side injector section high side injector section travel to voltage one is 12 voltage another is 48 voltage plus this is the plus voltage okay so how 12 voltage travel and how 48 voltage is travel let's see how it travel okay here you can see a two mosfet two this is diode so now i'm just going to make a diode like this and this is connected to injectors and we have one more mosfet n channel mosfet and this mosfet is connected to this anode this is the diode one side is anode and another side is cathode okay and this is the n channel mosfet n channel mosfet one side is 12 voltage another side is connected to this diode and this one this one is connected to our injector ic so 12 voltage switching from the injector ic and we have another one you can see here here we got a 48 voltage okay now just like that this is a diode okay and here we have a 40 voltage half 48 voltage 
if you didn't see a video go and watch that video so you will get how travel voltage is made okay so this this 48 voltage how to travel so this 48 voltage connect also one n channel drain 48 voltage and this is connected to one from one diode to this pin like this here you can see but this mosfet switching from not this injector ic the switching of this small ic 8 pin ic okay so 8 pin ic needs one 5 voltage reference one is ground and another one is connected to this ic and one more also connected to this this ic okay so this ic used for 48 voltage injector switching and this injector driver used to switch 12 voltage so this is the whole whole theory of one injector firing if you if you saw this these on this board on the time you can see the high side will switching at one time for two injector but low side have a another another each injector have each mosfet but high side have a two mosfet for one two uh, injectors for one mosfet okay so there this is the very simple and uh, very easy to understand there is a very uh, uh, some um, some resistance and uh, some components are also there but what i um, my aim is you, i just want to put in your mind the sections lining and according to this line we will check it and we will fix the problems and our ecm will be work as a new ECM. so guys if you get the knowledge from this video please do like share and subscribe to my channel and if you didn't visit a ramzon go and visit ramzon.in for more information and you can get a online classes also so if you want that duration is two months and uh, <coughs> uh, you didn't follow me on instagram uh, link is the descriptions you can go and follow the, follow me there also so thank you